Welcome to our second edition of Tie It Up Tuesday. Thank you so much ladies for all of your gorgeous comments and likes last week. We hope that you'll enjoy this week's video as well. We're working with a gorgeous fall forward scarf, rectangular this one, with a little bit of boho vibe to it, which prompted us to do a denim look. So I'm wearing the black uh, jean from Up, and I'm wearing the zigzag top from Simply, and I'm gonna bring the colors together with the help of this scarf. Now I love the neckline here, but if I wanted to change it up a little bit, that's where I go to my trusty friend, the scarf. We're gonna start tying it the same way as we did last week. So we wanna end up with a teardrop edge. So we'll start with an edge, lengthen it up, take it from the center, place it at the nape of the neck, bring one side up a little bit, bring the other side down, and then we're gonna do the basic European. Everyone knows this look. So we're gonna twirl it around the neck and bring it back. Now, for those ladies who feel that they have a shorter neck, this is what not to do. You don't want to keep it so close to the neck. So just bring it back, okay? And now zhuzh it a little bit. Keep it away from the neckline. See how right away that elongates the neck. I'm going to bring this other side back, okay? And now we're going to go Western. We're going to do the cowgirl. So we're going to keep, I'm going to bring this side a little closer to the center. And I'm going, what I want to do is I want to drape this other side over like so. So I want to keep this side fairly taut okay, and drape it nicely, bring it through like so, and again, keeping it away from the neck. What I like about this is that it replaces a necklace. It's certainly a statement piece. And a little slimming trick here, ladies, if you have a side part in your hair, start from that great vertical on top and keep it going on the same side here. Great slimming trick. Okay, yippity yahoo, we've got our first Western look down. And now we're going to change the complete look. So if I may, I'm going to change into a different look. We're going into a belted vest, yes, your scarf can now become a piece of clothing. So I'm going to another fabulous Simply piece. It's the long, the three quarter sleeve t-shirt, open neckline as well. I wanted something basic to work with. Reintroducing the scarf. And aren't these colors just gorgeous? So I'm gonna take it horizontally like this and I'm gonna ruch it up, okay? And again, place it at the nape of the neck. Just bring it down and I'm going to Fold, fold it here about an inch and a half to two inches at the neckline. I want to keep the neckline nice and neat and clean, okay? I want to make sure my edges are fairly um, equidistant at the bottom, okay? Now, if you're going out to a summer festival and you want to just wear your look like this on the jean, it looks pretty cool on its own. And the beauty of this fabric is that it won't slip off your garment. But I want to belt it. So I'm adding a bolo belt, and because I have a defined waist, I'm going to place this belt at the waist. If you don't have a defined waist, you may want to position it a little lower on the body. Okay, so I'm gonna bolo it up. And at this point, I want to bring my arms up because I wanna make sure that during the day, I'm going to have that range of motion with my arms. So here we are, I'm gonna tie it up. I'm doing this without a mirror, so I hope that this looks good. So keep it open like this. I want to showcase the fringe at the front. So again, I'm bringing all of this together, but you literally have created a vest in no time. And let me show you the back. It looks like a gorgeous shrug. Hope you like this. We look forward to your comments again, and we'll see you next week for another Tied Up Tuesday.